Fox, that came in on Monday. We're gonna check bloods on her just to make sure we're not missing anything else. She's doing a bit better. She's eating, but she still seems a bit sleepy. And as we just wanna make sure there's nothing wrong with her. We're gonna go on her jugular vein on one side of the neck to get some, uh, some blood to check her, to see if her liver is working, if her kidneys are working, if she's not too dehydrated, and also if she's anemic or she has an infection going on. So it will be a bit of a checkup for her. She can probably go back as soon as we make sure that it's not bleeding around the area. Looks good. And it looks good. I want to check her gums <laughs> without getting bitten, probably. Yeah, it's good. So we're going to put the fox back now, and now we're going to run the bloods. This is separating the blood. The blood is made by the red blood cells and white blood cells, and then there's a liquid part. So this, by spinning, uh, it makes them separate. So this is the separated blood. There's the liquid part on top of it. It's called plasma. And down here we have all the red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. We're gonna just get this top part to put in the machine to run the analysis. Everything seems fine so far. Possibly mild dehydration, but nothing to be concerned about, especially because she's now eating and drinking fine. Kidney seems fine, liver seems fine, so happy with the results. I'm also going to do a blood smear just to confirm the results of the machine, but so far it looks really good. So the last part of the fox's treatment today is just to give her her antibiotics. Um, so she gets this in her food, which we'll be giving to her now. Mm -hmm.